Hi everyone, welcome to Craft Vision. So a few days back, I was re reading a quote, which is actually a very famous quote that says, work smarter, not harder. A smart guy will always defeat a hardworking guy. So what do you think? Do you really think that life goes like this? The guy who is actually doing the smart work, that guy has already done a lot of hard work. Then only he is able to do the smart work. Let's just say today I give you a class 8 problem of mathematics based on linear algebra. Okay. Not linear algebra, linear equation. I give you a linear equation from class 8 and I ask you to solve it. Will you be able to solve it? Yes, very smartly you will be able to solve it. The class 8 guy would think that you are a very smart guy. But he should know that you have done engineering, you have give, you have written JE, you have done the engineering and it's been so much of time that you have seen these kind of things. You have done that much of hard work, that's why you are able to solve these kind of equations very smartly and very easily. If I'm teaching a particular circuit, say people ask me that, sir, sir, how did you build up that intu intuition? Sir, why you are not applying Laplace transform? How the intuition came into action? So that intuition doesn't come, come to me very smartly. It had a lot of hard work. I saw, a one, I saw one circuit, I sold it with Laplace transform. I saw the second circuit, I sold it again with the Laplace transform. I, then I noticed what is actually happening in the, in the circuit. Then I simulated it. Then I changed some component. In place of register, I connected a capacitor. Then I connected some inductor. Then I added some component. Then again, I did the analysis with the Laplace transform. Then, then again, I simulated it. So many circuits I saw. And after that, I built up my intuition. This is how the intuitions were built up. Things are not coming very directly. Things doesn't come to any person in this world very directly. There is nothing called God gifted. Okay. It is just a way to, it is just a way to calm ourselves that that guy is God gifted. But that guy has done a lot of hard work to reach there. In his childhood, he might have done it. In his adulthood, he might have done it. He might have done it when no one saw him doing that particular hard work. Okay. So you will never be able to do the smart work without doing the hard work. Right. If a teacher is making a particular tougher topic easy for you, then he might have sold a lot of examples on that. He would have seen a lot of derivations of that particular topic. He would have seen a lot of videos behind it, that. And then he would have built up something on his own. He would have made a script. He would have done a lot of things then he would have made that particular concept very easy whatever you see on screen that one hour of video that would have taken seven to eight hours of effort after that that particular thing would have made and you feel like that that is a smart work that is not a smart work that was the outcome of your hard work so smart work is nothing but the outcome of the hard work that you have done so never ever believe in these kind of code that you work smart not don't work hard it is just an escape for the people who don't want to work hard because working hard requires effort. Efforts require guts. And not everyone has the guts. Right? So, yeah, I just saw the quote and I thought of sharing this thing with you. That quotes are quotes only. But real life is completely different from that. So work harder. If you work harder, then surely one day you will be able to work smarter as well. Okay? Yeah. Just thought of sharing this thought. Thank you very much. Happy life.